guys, Cheesy Poof here. We got another one of the Ikis to show off for the collection today. And this one is gonna be Michelangelo from Ninja Turtles. I know I still have uh, several from the different Series 1 kind of ones that they've released that I need to show off, but getting Mikey, of course, I get excited and I felt like <laughs> we gotta show him off for the collection too. And as you noticed, for whatever reason, they decided to actually change the setup of these boxes. They were perfect pop size and there wasn't many issues with those boxes and they just decided to ruin all that, I guess. Not entirely sure why. I got one at uh, San Diego Comic Con this year that I still have to show off actually that was the first one I saw in this box and I thought it was a one-off. And they said how many issues they had with the boxes. Like they had to give me a new one because even like this you can see it's all torn off to the side. and. There's different areas that aren't even glued and really random stuff, you know, so I feel like this isn't the kind of figure that you want to show off in the box anyways, and the good news is that I don't want to. I put them with all my little tiki mugs and stuff, but I figured we'd talk a little bit about the box and I'm not sure why they ended up doing that, especially if you have just, you know, Leo and Raph like we, we did before, you can't even place them together to look like uniform or anything. So anyways, we'll go ahead and pull Mikey out so you guys can see him up close. The figure itself looks really badass though. So that's the good news is that I, I really like the art and the design. And I might have said these are vinyl figures before in the past, but they're definitely resin. And they're like, they're hefty though too. So they are just resin figures, which is still pretty nice that we're we're getting collectible resin. Anywho, you got his orange bandana going around, his happy looking eyes, he's even got little eyebrows, teeth coming out of his face, <laughs> his tongue popping out, ah! off to the side, he's got his nunchucks of course, which is kind of cool uh, art direction, they just literally painted it from the arms to the chest, back around, so that works. He does have little orange for his knee pads. They did not give him any elbow ones. On the back, there's the rest of his turtle shell with the belt. Pretty cool. The rest of his bandana and the green and everything. And then, really, really tiny. You got the, the logos that they keep on these things. So, Michelangelo. Made in China. Really tiny text. Throwing him up there, though. You can at least see how fancy he looks as a little tiki figure. <laughs> so pretty definitely looks really cool so let me know what you guys think of this variety of michelangelo and with that being said that's it for this time hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you later